In this video, we're going to look at place value. So if we start off with a number like 375.921, then you'll notice that the number is split up into columns. And these are represented by their place value. So each of these numbers have, has a distinct value. We start off with this position to the left of the decimal point. This is the units column. Okay, so 5 has a unitary value, 5 units. Then we have tens, so we have 7 tens, and 3 hundreds. To the right of the decimal point, well, sorry, if we kept going, then you would have uh, thousands, tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands, millions, tens of millions, etc. To the right of the decimal point, we begin with this column having tenths value. So we have nine tenths. You'll notice that there is no units column, okay? It would be difficult to say. So tenths, then we have hundredths, and finally thousandths. And of course it would go into tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands, and then millionths. Okay? And it keeps going either side. So it's important that you know um, the difference between a tenth and a hundredth, and what we mean when we say these words.